we'll go through some of the aspects of owning an antique vehicle and what that's involved as well. So let's go over here. We'll move over to the other segment of our show, which is the motorcycle aspect of it. This guy is a 1982 Seca 750. My son purchased this over the winter for $450. It was a non-running bike. It's been sitting for years outside doing nothing. We got her up and running. Now she's running absolutely perfect. We got the new carburetors set up in here. We rebuilt a lot of the parts in here. We got new engine work. We got everything done. You know, you know I want to start her up for you here, but my son forgot the keys. Cut. Hey guys, Johnny Racine here. We're about to take the uh, 74 Honda CB200 for its first little spin here. We got her up and running. We put a battery in it. I'm just going to go for a quick test run to see how it's going to perform and then we'll decide from there what kind of work is going to be, need to be done. So let's see. Let's see what happens when we take this uh, this bad boy out for a spin. We'll see what the clients have to say when they get back. I'm sure they'll be very surprised that uh, we got the old beast up and running. So. <laughs> the kickstand's on, buddy. The kickstand's on. Are we rolling? Yeah, we are. Uh, I don't see a light. Mm -hmm. Start over.